Jumping right in, I've already shampooed my hair with the Curl Defining Shampoo and now I am getting my hair ready for my deep condition process with the Curl Defining Conditioner. So what I do is I get a damp cloth a damp washcloth and I put it in the microwave for about one minute and then once it's out it's hot it's steaming steaming hot I like to put a plastic bag before I put the towel on my head because it is steaming hot so it's kind of just protect my scalp from that heat I put a plastic bag first and then I put on the damp towel that I microwaved and then I put on another bag over the towel so that that steam can kind of just stay in there and then I let this sit on my head for about 15 minutes or until until it gets cool because once it gets cool obviously it's not really doing what, what it's intended to do so after that's cool then I go wash it out in the shower before washing it out I do finger detangle what I like about this conditioner is how soft it makes my hair feel how soft and light and I guess that's because the conditioner is in my hair so once I wash it out then I'll be able to tell see if there's a difference in how my hair feels it's been feeling a little dry lately um, just from using gel and not necessarily a lot of moisturizing products and so I'm hoping that this product line will add moisture to my hair and one of the things that I notice is when I actually warm the comb through my hair the curl pattern does change and so I do like to finger detangle my hair I've been doing that um, a lot lately and kind of just staying away from the combs to just you know eliminate shedding and breakage so far this curl defining shampoo and conditioner seems to be doing what it's supposed to be doing we'll see after I wash it out so I'm just gonna continue finger combing through my hair just to ensure I get as much detangles as possible all right so I just got out of the shower and my hair definitely feels soft it feels really light and fluffy and moisturized which is what I like I'm gonna just blot dry my hair with this towel I don't want to make it too too dry but I also don't want my hair to be soaking wet so now that I feel like it's to my liking in terms of wetness I'm gonna separate my hair into sections to make it easier to apply the curl defining detangler followed by the combing cream so my hair is not as easy to finger detangle without any product in it. I mentioned before that it is so much easier to detangle when you have conditioner to add some slip. And so I don't want to finger detangle too much without any products because I don't want to break my hair unnecessarily. Now I'm going to go in with the curl defining detangler by Not Your Mother's Naturals. For this style, I am gonna be pretty heavy-handed with the products. This is my first time using these products, and I find that the more product that I have in my hair, the more my hair likes it. What I already like about this detangler is the fact that it goes on my hair clear. And look, now I can run my fingers through without any issues. I love it. It adds a nice amount of slip and I already see some definition there. I feel like my hair has been breaking a lot lately. I haven't gotten a proper trim since I've gone natural. I've done my little trims here and there, but I think it's time to get an actual cut. I'm due for one, so I don't want to use too much combs and brushes and things like that to break my hair even more. So now that I've added the detangler, I'm going to go in with the combing cream. I'm gonna start at the ends and then work my way up. I really do like that definition. I'm just gonna continue to rake it through to make sure to try to get all that frizz out and get my hair to clump a little bit more. So I do like that definition, but I already just seeing, it's not as defined as, as gel. I already kind of have an idea of what it's gonna look like when it dries. And so what I'm gonna do is go ahead and just twist it. And so that the curl patterns will be a little more defined so i'm doing this on the ends just to make sure that they coated properly and to make sure that they clump nicely together so i'm gonna go ahead and do this to the rest of my hair i like to coat my hands with oil before untwisting to decrease the amount of frizz and tangling
After the first untwist, I'm just going to go in and separate even more for a fuller look. I am pleasantly surprised at how this came out and I do like how defined the curls are. But I am going to work and I need my hair to be a little more professional looking and so I'm just going to pull it back like so. Thanks for sticking around to the end. Hit the thumbs up button if you like what you saw. Drop a comment below if you have any questions and don't forget to hit the subscribe button on your way out.